It's not surprising that everyone wants to team up with Google. That's why Google has made it easy for other technology tools to be integrated into Google Apps. Better yet, Google has also made access to this integration easy and convenient for its users. This screencast will demonstrate how to connect apps, add extensions, and enable gadgets right inside of Google Apps. First, let's visit Google Drive. In Google Drive, we are able to create things such as folders, documents, presentations, spreadsheets, forms, and drawings. But by clicking on Connect More Apps, this will allow us to connect to even more apps. We can first browse by all, and if we hover over any app, it will allow us to connect right into Google Drive. We can also browse by other categories such as education. Finally, we can also do a type search. By typing in Google, I'm going to explore all the different apps provided by Google. So, if I want to connect Wii Video, Video Editor, I can simply click Connect, click OK, and now Wii Video will appear right inside of Google Drive. Now, I can manage my apps by clicking on the Settings tool and going to Manage Apps. This will allow me to preview all of the apps that I have connected to my Google Drive. And if at any time I want to disconnect any, I can choose Options, click Disconnect from Drive, and click Disconnect, and click OK. Next, we'll need to make sure that we're using Google Chrome to be able to visit the Chrome Store. By selecting the Chrome Store, this is where we can add additional apps and extensions. For example, if I typed in the word Google, I will get all Google apps and extensions provided by Google. If I click Apps, I will get all the different apps that are available. But if I click Extensions, this is where I will get some additional extensions that will appear in the top right hand corner of my Google Chrome. For example, if I wanted to add a Google Translate gadget, I would click on Add to Chrome, click Add, and it will appear right up here as a Google extension inside of my Google Chrome browser. Finally, by going into our email, we can actually add different gadgets. By clicking the Settings tab and going to Settings, you'll notice a little button that says Labs. By clicking on Labs, this will enable us to add gadgets inside of our mail. You can see I have enabled a couple of gadgets inside of my mail already such as the Google Calendar gadget, Google Docs Preview and Mail, and inserting images. So, if you're looking to get even more out of your Google Apps account, try connecting to apps, adding extensions, and enabling gadgets.